Righty oh boys. Alright, so today we're gonna put out a bear bait and start bear hunting. Bowen brought the twenty two with because it's old. And he's gonna try and shoot squirrels or something or grouse if we see a grouse, but first oh, I just brought it. We're gonna walk back to the apple tree. There's a little rock back there that you can kinda stand on and there's a little meadow and I wanna see look from that view and see if there's a spot to maybe put a bear bait. And yeah, I got a Mountain Dew, so let's walk. Never know that evil little, look at that man, he's happy. Mm. Whose dad is that? What? Yeah. You never know that. Apple that, tree. That, They're coming up like right here. I saw that in the track. Are somewhere in here and they are going down there. Uh -huh. I went down there and there's a trail. Looks like it. I'm gonna look. Doesn't look used very often. It is. Because there's tracks everywhere up there. I don't think so. Yeah, there is. You gotta look, dude. But this doesn't look like much of a trail. I know. Well, no, actually, it's more of a trail back here. I say. I don't think a deer can get up that. But look. I don't think a deer's getting up that. That's like a five foot. Yeah, ledge. I don't know how something got there's a trail here though. I'd rather just walk down and eat those. Huh? Alright, it's down task. We're looking for bears. No. And squirrels and mm -hmm. grouse. Yeah. Really anything that breeds. Alright. Back up. Ooh. What, are we doing what are we doing in town later? I have to get stuff for a bear bait. Icing! Icing? I, yeah, icing. Why icing? Huh? Icing? Like for a cupcake. Why would you get icing for a cupcake? For the bear bait! Why? Because. I don't know, maybe you can use it. Maybe. All right, down the waterfall trail. Look, I've seen somebody use it for a bear bait. It's just it ain't open enough. I feel like you get the chainsaw and drop that tree right there and a couple other trees. Open it up a little bit so you can actually see back there. But I'm thinking we'll hop on the four-wheeler and drive around and see if there's another spot. I think it's with a bear bait. You kind of need to be able to get to a spot where you're up above. Well, not up above them, but you can go around the bait and not have to walk through it. So if there's a bear and you're going in early in the morning, you don't scare them off. Can we go back there later? I feel like there, I, earlier, I feel like I saw a cave and I want to go up there and see if there's a cave. Up there? Yeah, up on that mountain. If you walk at the, on the front of the house, it looks like there's a cave, like a big black spot. I don't think there's a cave there. Maybe there's a bear. I know there's bears back here. Just got to find them. So let's figure this out. All right, here's the thing. I'm thinking we can walk across, jump across the creek to there, and then walk across right there over there. We might be able to get up above it. First, we got to figure out how to get down this. Down to you. I know, but it's steep, and I'm trying to hold the phone and my Mountain Dew. Oh. Parkour. No, Bowen, I have a different idea. No, we can well, gonna walk up right there. I see. Huh? I'll be right there. That's where we did that bird go. Parkour. Hold on. I'm gonna grab the. Let me get across. Alright, give me that. Bolt is open. Oh, that's kind of oh. Oh. Made it. Good job. 
All right, here's the gun. I'm gonna climb up there, then I'll take the gun from you. Okay. Now up this rock face. We're rock climbing. Ugh. All right, give me the gun. There's like a mini cave right there, out of a tree stump. Yeah. Ugh. All right, take this. I'm gonna climb up to here. Oh. Let me take that. All right, I'm a quicker one. No, Bowen, we're going up here. How are you going to get up here now? I have a way. Give me a second. Right here. Oh. Well, come on. Just easier to get. Yeah. Alright. Uh, Take this. Yeah. Take this. Bet you there's fish right there. Huh? Bet you there's fish right there. Probably. Alright. Up this way now. Oh, a little snake. Where? Right here. How big is it? Tiny. Got him. Huh? Got him. Look at him. I know he's His name is Georgie. All right, let George go. He wants to give you a kiss. Ooh. Be free, Georgie. Oh, oh, oh. oh he fallen. He fell down the rocks. Oh, he's there now. He's okay. He's oh. kind of Georgie's good. All right, hi ho. Um, no, I don't try to crawl I, through this. I'm gonna shut you off. Right we did it. We're amazing. We made it to the top. I'm thinking. Scooch around a little bit. And there's an opening right there. Hopefully there's a clear spot that we can sit from and shoot from. Probably not with a bow. Probably be a rifle thing, but still. Just keep scooching, I guess. See any squirrels? Just keep going. I can't hear you when you whisper. <laughs> Ow. Bruh. Uh. You know, it's not looking like it's opening up. Oh, we found the river. Call us Lewis and Clark. At, oh, call us Lewis and Clark, I guess, because we're finding things, right? Call us Lewis and Clark? Yeah. No, Lewis and Clark. That's what I just said. Good call us. Call us, Lewis and Clark. We're finding things. Okay. Hi, ho. I want to see if we can see off the top of this rock ledge. Any better? Ow! Spider in my mouth. Jeez, there's just always trees in the way. The way's up here though. Why is there no open spot? Uh -huh. What the heck, dude? Well, guys, I think I found a spot. Kind of sit right here, scooch down a little bit put the bait right there in that thing. The grass is actually really tall down there though. It's farther up than I'd want it to be, but it is a nice open spot. Just a little bit a little bit of a jump to get back here, which is fine. We can clear up the trail and make it better. I can all see that meadow over there. I even make a good deer hunting spot, you never know. Bowen. He's doing his thing. He's grumpy. He doesn't want to walk anymore. But I told says to him, if you want a bear, you gotta do the work. You know what I'm saying? That's a big tree. Anyway. Oh, ow. That hurt. Might find a spot a little bit lower. The thing is though, we have to come through that way we just came through. Otherwise you have to walk through the meadow and you'll walk right through the bait you don't want. I mean, it'd almost be perfect to sit right here and look right there, right down the valley. Might even see a bear come right there. Might see a bear come up behind you. Might have one right on top of you. 
Hey, Bowen, I found a grouse. Yeah. It's dead. What? It's dead, bro. Why would it be dead? I just watched it fly. Now he's gone. Gone where? You scared him. All flew into the trees. Huh? It's a part of it. You gotta find it. Well, I wasn't over here, so I don't know where it is. Where'd you see? Colton. Over there. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna walk down here a little bit and see what I see. I think right there is a good spot. I'm gonna mark it on the map real quick so I don't forget, but I'm pretty sure I know where that is because my bait's pretty, my, not my bait, my trail cam's close to it, so. I'm gonna throw a rock down the hill. Nice. Alrighty guys, this was the two bushes we were looking at from right there at that log. Oops. There with the branches sticking up. But there's a little bit of a divot. I'm thinking get the bait barrel. And chain it up to this stump possibly because you can still see it. Right here, mat down some of this grass, but then where do I put the trail camera? It's my question. I have to think a T post or something. Get it where I want it. I'll figure that out later. But anyways, we're gonna go into town now and get what we need. That is where I'm putting the bait barrel. Two hours later. Alrighty, boys. We made it down here. We got dog food. We got maple syrup, the cheapest syrup i could find at harvest foods we got our barrel some boards put on top of the barrels dog food cheapest dog food i could find and syrup and a chain to wrap around this stump here and then i'm gonna put a big old rock on top of the boards and then if they knock it off you know it's a bear i'm gonna kind of keep them out and try to get them to go through that hole there but nevertheless we have our bait we're gonna get it set up i'm not sure what bowen's gonna do he'll probably sit there right Lately, sold the camera. Mm. He's gonna sit there and be basically a tripod. So I'm gonna get this set up. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, I got, hope you guys enjoyed that time lapse. Now we're gonna pour this dog food in there. And put a syrup on the fourth and top, put a big rock, and then we'll put the trail cam in front of it, hopefully catch something. So Ugh. Like this. Come along, Bowen. Come on, Bowen. I am, I'm right next to you. No, come here. <laughs> That's a hole. Yeah, you don't need to be zoomed in on my face. Oh, so taking care of that. <laughs> Say hi. Um, All right. Um, go out. Okay, there we cut go. This open. Get yeah, cut it open. We're gonna video you cutting it open. Always cut towards yourself, kids. No. Tiny crumbled dog food is cheap. Ugh. Oh, I'm falling. I think you should have gotten another thing of dog food, maybe. Perfect. That's good enough. All right, now throw it. I'm falling. Bite size, Bowen. You can have some of it. That is. Yeah, why are you standing right on top of me? I'm not. I'm just. Just. <laughs> oh, shaking. Oh, that is some tiny dog food. Also, oh, there's All a right. giant hole right. Oh, you can't see it on camera. It's yeah. hard. Get some of that on there. So that I mean, pretty much all of it. All of it. You mean? That smell floats through the air with the dog food. 
Focal and then on. we have our hole. Right there. You almost just got it on I the know, phone. Watch out or you're gonna get syrup on you. So we had some of the syrup down out here so that the smell permeates. And I'll take some. Right there. Put on the boards. Is that all you brought? What? I thought you had to get marshmallows or something. I was going to, but it feels not to. Well, is that all you got? Yeah. That seems a little boring. This seems a little boring. Well, there's like nothing. No, you don't need a whole lot. This is simple bear baiting for beginners. No, but I thought you were going marshmallows. See, that's a nice, it's a nice soup in there. All right, and then we'll take these. Look at that up there. Uh, syrup. That's nice. Hey, come on, pal. There we go. On top of the board, get the scent everywhere as best we can. Let's get that back a little bit. Pick up your garbage, kids. First rules of being in the woods of survival. Number one, always cut towards yourself. And number one, always pick up your garbage. Okay, what's next? Um, okay. Over here. I gotta figure out where to put this. Huh. I didn't think that far. Um, no trees, maybe that bush. I don't know if that bush is strong enough to hold this. We can break some branches and find out. There's still a hole here. Where is there not a hole? There's a bee's nest in this. Huh? Get you out of my way. There's a bee's nest? Was. There's a bee's nest on the ground. Where? This And there you go. So we'll come back and check that camera <laughs> later. You'll probably see some shorts of that. But otherwise, that is how you set up a bear bait. All you need is dog food and syrup. You, you probably just have dog food, honestly. You don't even need a barrel. Just find a stump and pour it inside the stump. Dad's done that before. I was too young to remember, but I've heard he did it. We found a barrel in the yard, so we cut a hole in it, bent the metal back. Now we're doing that, so catch you all on the next one.